County Quorum Court votes to establish a date, time, and site of its monthly meeting. But meeting middays isn't sitting well with people who work. NBC 10's Gabrielle Pfeiffer visited with the county and spoke about what's behind this decision. They have been holding their meeting at 2.30 midday for nearly 40 years. 1979-1980, I was the Ashley County judge. Quorum Court set the time and we met. The only change in all that time, just one hour. They used to meet at 1.30. Ever since I've been here, the meetings have been at 2.30. Ricky Sims has been justice that's, of that's the peace in the county right for 11 uh, years. Quorum Court meetings are open to the public, but many residents tell us they want to attend the meeting but can't. There are a lot of people in the community and in the county that would love to attend the meetings too that work during the daytime. And they're, they're not able to attend the meeting, you know, because of their work requirements. Jeffress is a former Quorum Court member. He says the meeting time was even an issue for him. And it was always difficult for me to be able to make the meetings and attend uh, without having to uh, take off from, from work. Five counties, including Calhoun, Columbia, Washita, Bradley, and Drew counties, all meet after five. Three counties, including Union, Ashley, and Chico, meet during the morning or midday. Sam says although the times didn't change this year. The Corn Court will consider if enough taxpayers come and ask us, I write and tell us, I call and tell us, and the judge would ask us, we will consider it. A consideration that will have to be taken up next January. Reporting in Ashley County, Gabrielle Pfeiffer, NBC 10, your local news leader. Judge Jim Hudson says they're considering doing a live broadcast of the meetings as a happy medium.